Yeah, Gemini, why are you in a rush? Okay, I feel like you can slow down, you can take your time, I understand that you want to grow, I understand that you have big ideas, I know you want to expand, I know you want to have more than what you have, know more than what you currently know, however, right now you're stable, you're good, okay, stability is good as well, don't sit in stable too long, but it feels like a very rushy, rushy energy, and I don't know, is the risk calculated? Yeah. All right. I was called to do your reading just purely oracle based. So here we go. I'm a mirror, by the way. <laughs> if it's your first time here, don't forget to hit that like button, guys. Exchange energy with me. Okay. Return it. Return it. Um, comment down below. Let me know how the situation or reading resonates for you. Check out my website to book a personal session with me. All right. Yeah interesting cancer just got that all right maybe you're dealing with a cancer yeah you have fourth house sitting right here all right hmm. yeah moon and gemini all right so i feel like you're being really hard on yourself right now gemini okay i'm not sure what that's about or why or all right, let's just see what comes out, please. Okay. I feel like somebody is really uncomfortable with where they are. That's a part of why you want to grow, expand your yeah, resistance, okay? Mm -hmm. Mercury and Taurus. Somebody wants to change by, by any means necessary. I will bust through this wall if I have to do it, okay? All the naysayers will learn in the process and you have romance okay more taurian energy you could be dealing with the taurus here but this 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 taurian energy i mean we're in in earth energy right now it's virgo season to for for starters okay um but this has to do with your your money your your home your property you know all right yeah i feel like somebody's relationship Okay, I heard it's on the rocks, but that's not, that is genuinely not what I meant, what I was intending to come out of my mouth. Um, there's a decision here that's going to affect a relationship. Okay, significantly, yeah, more Taurian energy. Dang, you got two, two, two showing up here. All right, I guess I can show you the cards. <laughs> I'm being selfish, sorry. <laughs> Oh, yes, okay. I mean, if never in your life have you seen a broken nail, there's one for you today. <laughs> anyway, all right, so I guess we're taking this. Yeah, and then you have power, eighth house. So, yeah, somebody's like trying to bulldoze their way into a situation or, I don't know, it just feels really forceful. Okay, it feels really forceful. Maybe the timing is off here with something. Yeah, assertiveness. Okay. Is it assertive or is it aggressive? All right. That's the question. All right, let's go here. What's, what's next? What do, you, what do you have here for John? Yeah, so ostentation, romance, and resistance. Okay, for the love of money. Yeah. Anybody's money. My money, your money, their money. Okay. <laughs> My property, your property, their property. Okay. Somebody is very determined here. Achievement, effort plus intention, number 49. I'm not really sure what's going on, but success is definitely at the forefront, okay, from what I'm seeing, yeah. And then here we have another bull. My thing is, right, okay, maybe you have a significant tourist placement here. And then you have River of Blessings, Releasing Constraints, number 47. So 47 and 49 may be of significance to somebody here. Okay. That reduces to four. And two, which we already have on board. Big decisions that are going to affect home and family or like, yeah. 
your level of security. It feels like it's at risk here. Okay. What else do you have for Gemini? I, I'm hearing something about picking up the pieces. Okay, something's very confusing. I'm seeing literally puzzle pieces, but like, it's like, you know, the puzzle was once together. It feels like the puzzle was once together and then there was some kind of accident, okay? Yeah. I feel like maybe there were poor choices made in the past here or there was literally some kind of accident or somebody experienced a tower moment is what it feels, right? There's some kind of mishap that, that put me back some notches and I shouldn't be here. So now I'm going full force. That's what this feels. All right. Yeah. I'm getting something too about a, about a ring. So is this about marriage? Okay. Okay. Fatherhood, masculine energy. Okay. Very masculine energy just throughout this, this message. All right. Um, what do you have for Gemini, please? Thank you. <laughs> okay. Gemini, I feel like you're 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 very spiritually connected at this time. Maybe you're meditating, changing your diet, okay? Um things of this sort. Yeah, again, we're in this earth energy Virgo season where a lot of us are focused on our health, focused on our routine, focused on being self-disciplined and having self-control and ensuring our independence, stability. It feels like that's what somebody's focus is, is like heavily on. Okay, but yeah, I'm getting something about a father figure here as well. Like I said. Okay, somehow those two things are connected. Maybe maybe it's the, the sign of Virgo or the habits or I don't know. It's going to be different for each of you if it even applies. Okay. okay, yeah. I feel like too somebody needs like... <laughs> yeah. There's a need to like four swords, okay? Yeah, inner, inner, um, inner power, the Divine Father again. Um, Divine Father, thank you for co-creating my world with me. Yeah. And then you have connect with music. Thank you, angels, for inspiring. Wow. <laughs> for inspiring me through music. Anyway, I was getting ready to say, um, there's a need to find that meditative space of peace, okay? Let's get a little bit more here and then I'm gonna close out. Yeah, there's a lot going on. Okay. Somebody is showing a significant amount of determination. I feel like they're I feel like they're really inspired as well. Okay. And just determined. Simply <laughs> Okay, let's see. That's the one. Shaman, trust in higher forces. Yeah. Again, you're really connected spiritually at this time, or your your guides are very much supporting you. And then you have wise one, grow within your current situation. Alright, that's what I have for you.